traders. Matt from the Trade Brigade here doing a technical analysis on ticker symbol FSLY for Fastly Inc. On the left-hand side, we have the daily time frame, and on the right-hand side, the 30-minute intraday time frame. First things first, we have not yet covered this one on the channel, so we'll start by giving ourselves that daily roadmap where we always start from. Uh, so just noting obvious areas of support and resistance, right? So here we go. There's a quick range. We also have this as a high up here, and then underneath us as support, noting this prior earnings cycle gap down gave us support at and around that 34 whole dollar. So all things considered, chart's not looking so great, right? We have this range from in here and we're breaking down out of it. And typically we would look for continuation down into the next major support, which as we mentioned is at 34. If there's an upturn, I'm also noticing that we have this sort of resistance trend line. So coming in from the highs, connecting some of the dots here, uh, you know, firstly, a back test to this could just be exactly that, a back test of the breakdown point looking for the short for lower. Even if it does move slightly higher, again, you have overhead resistance right there again at the resistance trend line. Maybe it rolls lower off of that. So overall, not really too optimistic about a long-sided trade here, especially if I zoom out, right? This stock has been struggling for quite some time, noting that we have high, lower high, lower high, lower high, lower high. Same thing with the lows, right? Technically, if you come in from here, lower low, lower low, and lower low now. So just not the most uh, beautiful chart or optimistic rather to the upside here. The only sort of case that would build the upside here would be if this is a look below and fail. And this might take some time to unfold, but if we get price acceptance back above 39, back above the bottom end of this range, again, it might go sideways for some time before really unfolding. Technically speaking, the top end of the range should be the target at and around 45. Again, that's extremely optimistic and based on everything we just discussed, I don't really think it's a likely scenario. In terms of the 30 minute intraday time frame chart, let's take a look through the lens of the FIB, then wrap this video up up coming in from the highs down to the lows what you'll notice is that we never even came close to the 38.2 on a retest so let's draw that in as resistance of course here at 37.87 we'll remove that and that's going to be the first step in the right direction right so anything that's here you know maybe we consolidate and get a break to retest the 39 zone uh, but again just a step in the right direction note all the overhead resistance which we discussed if we remain below look for a bear flag take out the lows to get us into that 34 target underneath if you enjoyed today's video or learned anything new let me know in the comment section or by giving the video a thumbs up. Don't forget our main channel is linked in the description and all of that being said, I wish you a green trading week.